Hello friends, my name is Sid Shah. Welcome to Help Libraries uh, Small Help Talks. In this uh, talk show, but before that, I'll uh, introduce myself. So, uh, our, our academy is called Think and Grow Rich Academy and we represent the Nepodan Hill Foundation in India from USA. Uh, we, uh, in this short help talk, we are going to cover a very simple concept that how is a habit formed? Habits are very crucial for any person's success, happiness. And many a times we confuse that how is a habit formed and we all have the willpower to change the habits but we don't know how exactly that is possible. And there are many theories now that if you do keep on repeating the same things for say n number of times, say 21 number of times or there is one more school of thought where 60 uh, times if you repeat a particular thing then that particular thing would become a habit. Well friends there is a truth in that for sure and maybe a habit is formed by that by, by changing your neural pathways. But over here, I am going to give you a very different take on how a habit is formed. It's a very ancient concept of how a habit is formed and maybe you will be able to understand and give some importance that this is also a way how a habit can be formed. So um, it's simple friends. So let me start off with, first if you want to know, change a particular thing or want to develop a particular thing as a habit, you need to understand the three concepts which I call of anything, the what the how and the why all right so any particular thing for example let's say you want to get up early in the morning let's assume for that as an example so if that particular thing is the what of it so you know the what is the habit which you need to form so that means you have the knowledge that how this habit is going to be formed now how is this going to be formed so this particular domain will have the skills the skills that how you are going to get up early in the morning. Maybe you will set an alarm which is uh, not beside your bed, you will keep it somewhere far off. You will have a buddy calling you at a particular time in the morning to wake you up in the morning. You will do n number of things before going off to sleep and uh, you will do all that stuff. So that is the how or the skill sets that how you develop that habit. But most importantly friends, the third domain is the desire or the why. That why you want to get up early in the morning at 5 o'clock or whatever time it is that this particular thing has to be very clear and friends when you know all of these th things together the what the how and the why then what is this intersection over here over here is what will come as a habit for you friends and this will remain for you for a lifetime friends i hope in this particular different uh, way of looking at a habit it might give you some insights that okay this is the way my old habits are and i want to develop these new habits uh, if you want to know more about our academy you can contact us on sitsha.co.in my mobile number is 9820023589 thanks for watching the video i hope it was useful for you thank you